This is an explanation of the battery indicator uh, gauge reading that was added to version 1.5 of the gauge face application. So to start with, just as a background here, on, uh, on my Harley Sportster in the manual, uh, Harley explains that the reading uh, in volts um, when you're disconnected on the battery at 12.7 volts is 100, uh, indicates 100% charge. And then we go down various levels down to uh, 10.8 or less, which is a 0% charge. And so, in gauge face, let me start it up here. Um, if you go into the setup screen and then go into settings, you'll see in 1.5 we added a voltage calibration. And by default, it has a 1.2 volt offset. And so that requires a little bit of explanation. I'm going to set it to zero so that we can zero out uh, our, our testing. Okay? And so what you'll need is a voltmeter, or in this case, we're going to use a multimeter. And with the, the bike turned off, I'm just going to put on our hot and ground out the, uh, this voltmeter and see what our charge, current charge is, our disconnected charge. All right, so we're a little over, well, at uh, 13, just a hair over 13 volt. So we're actually uh, in excess of, of a, of a uh, full charge, I guess. Um, and so now what I'm going to do is uh, in the gauge face app again with uh, voltage calibration overridden to, to be zero. I'm going to go back to a gauge and connect up gauge face and then turn the bike on. And so what we should see is, okay, 11.0 is what we read on startup. And so what's happened there is when we start up the bike, we test with our electronics what the uh, battery condition is or what the volt level is off the battery. And of course, you know, I've got the, ba the, the bike charged, uh, or sorry, turned on, um, which fires up some of the bike's electronics, including you know the headlight and so on. So there's a bit of a draw off the battery at that point. So even though I have a fully charged battery, I'm reading 11.0 volts. Um, so 11.0 versus uh, the 13.0 uh, is, is, is a two volt difference. Um, and so what I could do is now override my voltage calibration to account for that difference of two volts. Now, by default, it was set to 1.2, and that's because it seems like on a lot of bikes that seems to be about the right uh, place to set it. Um, but I'm going to just go with what we just tested there. We probably have to run a few tests to see, you know, if that number is about right or not. And so, over it into two. Start the bike up again. And now we're reading 12.9, which is a little bit closer indication of, of reality of a full charge. And so that's basically it. So it's just a way to get a basic uh, indication of the general battery condition when you uh, first uh, start your bike up. Hope that helps. Take it easy.